guys, this is Ender Quartz here, back with a new tutorial. And this time I'm going to show you something that I have never seen anybody do before. Because, um, I don't really know. I mean, it's actually pretty simple. Wait, sorry. Then, um, it's actually pretty simple. And I just want to show you guys. So basically I figured out a way so that when you throw a snowball, it summons a fireball going in the same direction as the snowball... And then that fireball, it's, and then it kills the snowball. That's the fire, fireball is going in one direction. And then when the fireball explodes, it doesn't do any damage to blocks. It only does damage to physical, which it only makes a fireball like in a creeper explosion. It's like where you, where you had a creeper with fuse zero. It's exactly like that, but it's the same fireball, but it doesn't destroy any blocks. And so I want to show you guys, I don't know if this is a feature of just the snapshots, but I hope it's a feature of 1.8, because this is pretty cool. So I'm just going to show it to you guys first before I show you the command. So I have a snowball in my inventory, this is a normal snowball, now I'm going to throw it, turn to a fireball, and boom, does an explosion, but it doesn't damage any blocks. So I can throw as many of these as I want, I'm, I'm rapidly throwing these, and I'm just throwing these bunch like crazy, and so these are all... Um, fireballs with explosion power five, and I'll, I'll get into that a little later. I'll get into that. Sorry. Um, and so, if I throw it upwards, then the fireball goes upwards. If I throw it to the side, then the fireball goes there. Again, it's a little laggy, so all I have to see is the smoke. But it is going in that direction. So if I throw it downwards, it does go downwards. And if I throw it downwards over here, and if I point it over there, you can actually snipe a little bit to go over there because it instantly transforms a snowball into the fireball so that whatever you point whatever direction you point the snowball at that's where the fireball is going to go so if I point it directly at this thing let me throw it and then boom it's going to explode and then so that's really cool and I'm going to show you guys it seems like it's very complicated but it's actually only one command block and again I really hope this is point a feature of 1.8 and I hope this is, I really hope this is a feature of 1.8 because this would be really cool and really good for map makers. Um, and so what it does is that's actually an execute command. So what it does first is it's slash execute, then at e type equals snowball. So it's, it's testing for a snowball in the world. And then on that snowball, then it'll summon, whenever it finds any snowball in the world, it's going to summon a fireball, the explosion power 4 and direction 0 0.0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Basically the same fireball effect, but it's doing direction 0, 0, 0, and it's always executing on that snowball. And I mean, I don't really know exactly how it works, because in my mind, it should, the snowball should go, and then it should leave a trail of stationary fireballs, but if this is a bug, I really hope that they don't remove it, because it's really good. And I think, I don't really know why it doesn't destroy blocks. I mean, I don't I don't think that's just because of my world. Because I've done just regular fireball things before. And wait, I'm just going to try this right here. So I'm just going to summon a regular fireball. Summon fireball. Wait. Um, doop, doop, doop. And now, um, explosion power. Um... Four, comma, um, direction, um, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, and then, so, so that, that's, there's a fireball right there, it's kind of glitchy, but it's right there, and that's when I throw it, I don't know if that's just because of my world, or it's just fireballs in general, but this isn't creating, doesn't seem to be creating any, damage underneath that but that may be a change to 1.8 that might that might be a change so i don't know but if that is a change if that, if that is a change that they added and they wanted to do that or it's just a bug i really hope that they keep it because it is really awesome either way it's really awesome so that's pretty much it i mean and that's that's a cool thing about execute commands is that you can throw multiple mo more than one at once so let's watch this i can throw one and then i can throw the other or I can throw both of them at the same time, and it'll still work, and that's what's really cool about it, because it'll still work in multiple of these, and that's why I can throw so many of them at once and rain terror upon my enemies <laughs> and destruction. I'm just kidding. But, um, so.
so that's it. I mean, I just wanted to show you guys that, how it's pretty cool. And so you guys can use this however you want. And so I think it'd be really cool for map makers. Maybe they maybe they can make a mini game out of it or something. They'd be a really cool mini game if you had kind of spleef, but it would have these snowballs, and then you would try to kill each other, but then the fire would ignite the TNT, which would cause it to fall down or something. I don't know. You could you could create you could create a bunch of crazy stuff with this. And then so I think that's it. I mean, again, you guys can just customize this however you want and do whatever you want with it and throw fireballs at things and watch them explode. But, um, oh, I wa sorry, I wanted to show you one more thing. It does do damage to mobs, too. So it's like, a, again, it's like a creeper explosion. So it'll do damage, and then, boom, it'll kill all of the mobs, too. But it won't damage any of the blocks. So I think that's a really cool thing about it. So, wait, I just want to do one more test just to see if it's anything wrong with my world. So, summon prime dandy. Okay, so it's nothing wrong with my world. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that there was nothing wrong with my computer and it wouldn't load explosions, but apparently it does. So, I don't know if that's a new fireball fix or, again, I don't, I don't really know. But I hope you guys out there and the community everywhere just use this, this technique just to improve your maps and do other things like that. Now, I actually discovered this by chance. I mean, I was trying to make it so that when a snowball lands, the creeper does this and all this stuff happens. I was trying to make it kind of like a grenade thing, and then I just stumbled upon this, and I was like, whoa, this is really awesome, so I did a bunch of tests, and then so, that's pretty much it, and so it's really cool how you can snipe things from really far away, because it retains its direction, so if I go over here, and then I'm like, boom, and the fireball goes way over there, and then boom, it explodes, and so it's really good, because before you had to hit fireballs, where they would go, and then they would, and then they would fly, and then sometimes they would go unpredictably, and then it would just, it would be kind of a mess sometimes. But, um, I think that's it. I mean, again, you guys can just use this however you want, and do whatever you want with it. And then, so, I think this is it. See you guys later.